Hello, I'm State Representative Larry Springer from the 45th Legislative District. This is my second video update of this short legislative session that we assume will be over about March 10th or so. The session is fully underway, and because it is a short session and it's almost half over, you can sort of feel the energy level beginning to escalate. People are getting worried about getting their bills out, so it's starting to get very busy and pretty hectic down here. Awful lot of interest groups are coming down. Certainly encourage any of my constituents to come down anytime to try and visit and set up an appointment. Would love to sit down and talk with you. Let me highlight for you a couple of issues that are important. One, a bill we passed off the floor of the House this morning. It's a bill we passed last year, and we reintroduced it this year because it did not pass the Senate. And that's a bill to assure that our employers in Washington state will pay women the equivalent amount they pay men for substantially the same work. It's called the Equal Pay Act, sponsored by Representative Tana Sen. The bill got broad bipartisan support. It assures that women who in this state right now make about 70 cents on the dollar for similar employment as do men will be paid fairly. More importantly, it even sets up a system by which we ban any retaliation against a woman or any employee for discussing their salary ranges with other employees. So big step forward for equity. It's good for women and certainly good for families. Uh, women are 40% of the breadwinners in this state. The other issue I wanted to touch on was the 405 toll lanes. I mentioned that in my first video update. And I said we would be working on making some changes. I can tell you now that a letter was sent to DOT yesterday, uh, signed by all of the uh, House of Representative members along the 405 corridor, directing DOT to make some changes, including removing all restrictions in the toll lanes on weekends, holidays, and evening hours. So in short order, you should be able to use those toll lanes, whether you're a carpool or not, free of charge on weekends, holidays, and evening hours. We also allowed buses to use the shoulder driving, and we're gonna be making some entry and exit changes to the toll lanes later on. So we're making some progress there. We're not done yet, but we are trying to make that corridor function a little bit better. So again, thanks for listening, and I wanna encourage you to make sure you contact me if there's anything on your mind. My contact information's on the screen, and I'll send you another update in a week or two. Thanks a lot for listening.